Factsverse presents Muslim restaurant hung a huge sign outside their door for Christmas, and it went viral. Muslims celebrating Christmas? What kind of topsy-turvy backwards world are we living in, huh? Well, we'll find out in just a moment. First, though, click that like button to let others know that you're watching this video. And also, be sure to subscribe and click the notification bell so you don't miss our future videos. For years, when people heard about Muslims, they automatically thought about terrorists. And it's a sad reality that some people still feel this way. But it's the reality of the world that we live in, unfortunately. There are, however, plenty of Muslims out there who want people to see that religion doesn't make you a terrorist or even a bad person. When this Muslim restaurant hung a huge sign outside their door on Christmas, it went viral, and it proves that Muslims are really good people. During the holiday season, it's not uncommon to see signs outside of stores and restaurants. Owners use these signs as a way to get customers to come in off the street. When Hassan Masood hung a sign outside of his restaurant, he wasn't trying to get people to come in off the street so he could make a profit. He had a very different reason for this sign. The restaurant is called Shish and it's located in London. Hassan is Muslim and he serves Turkish food. People of the Muslim faith, they don't celebrate Christmas. For people who practice Islam, Christmas is just another day of the year. Even though Hassan doesn't celebrate Christmas, though, it doesn't mean he didn't want to spread some holiday cheer to others. A few days before Christmas, he put a sign outside of his restaurant, and it read, Free of charge, no one eats alone on Christmas Day. We are here to sit with you. Three-course meal for the homeless from 12 p.m. to 6 p.m. Any homeless or elderly welcomed. Well, many people saw the sign, and they were impressed. What was even more impressive was that Hassan added the menu at the bottom of the sign. He wasn't giving out turkey sandwiches and soup like most soup kitchens offered. He was offering a delicious meal that consisted of soup and chajik to start, followed by a choice of the main course. People could choose either chicken casserole, vegetarian casserole, or chicken shish. Finally, he would be serving rice pudding for dessert. Considering he was going to be giving out this food for free, the spread he was offering was pretty amazing. When he was asked why he would do something so kind and generous, he said that he believed that too many people stay home alone on Christmas because they don't have anybody in their life to spend the holidays with. He says that he doesn't want anybody to have to be alone on Christmas Day. He says if somebody comes in alone and they want some company, he would be more than willing to sit down and join them. Shortly after Hassan put the sign in the window of his restaurant, it went viral. Many people walked by the sign and took a photo of it, and it wasn't long before people were sharing the photo and people from all over the world saw Hassan's kindness. Thousands of people commented on the photo, thanking Hassan for his kind gesture. What impressed people the most was that this restaurateur didn't even celebrate the holiday himself. He just wanted to make sure that the people who need the most help will be able to enjoy a hot meal on a day that can be very tough for people who are alone. Hassan says that he didn't post the sign and plan the Christmas meal to show people that Muslims are kind and generous people, though. He says that what some people think about people who practice his religion doesn't really bother him, and it's not his responsibility to change people's views about Islam. He just wants to be there for people who are lonely and needy on the one day of the year that people should be together. He says that on Christmas, he won't be making any money. In fact, he'll be losing money. But the money's not important, he says. He just wants to share the Christmas spirit with people when they need it the most. There's no word as for whether Hassan is going to be doing the same thing this coming Christmas, but considering what a big heart he has, there's a good chance that the elderly and the homeless in his area aren't going to be alone again this year. Subscribe for more!